Hi there. So in this video, I'm going to show you how to view the MongoDB's database collection with the help of Java. Okay, so for this, we will first create new project, then add the Mongo client jar file in your project path, and then write our code. So first thing, let's create one Java project. Go to file, new Java project. Here, let's type in Mongo demo. Then click next. Then add external jar in your libraries tab. Click on add external jars. You have to point to this Mongo Java driver. Once you do that, click on finish. Okay, now that jar is in project path create new class file okay let's name it demo mongo then we have public static void main as our method here pre-built so we will just select that and click on finish okay the next thing to do is we will first call for mongo client within try catch block so mongo client mongo client equals to new mongo client inside this have local host and then name of port 27017 just make sure that your mongo and mongo services are running okay as you can see, here we have three databases to check from MyDB, MyDemo, and MyRSDemo. Okay, we will choose one of from them. Next thing, use db db equals to mongo client dot get db. And here we specify the database that we want to access. In my case, let's go with my demo, or you can go for your own. In my case, I have my DB, my demo, and my Iris demo. Okay, now let's go ahead and print out message that my database is connected. Okay. And in try block, sorry, in catch block, I have exception E. Okay, which I'm going to print out system out print in E. Okay, so that's pretty much all you have to do here. Just one more thing is we have to call for our specific collection my db collection call equals to db dot get collection okay so choose from first and then specify your collection okay so in so in my case, I'll just keep it as is, get collection, my demo, or my demo. Okay, next thing, we'll have cursor, cursor. Okay, so call dot find, and we'll find that. Then, we will use while loop and we will have our loop to check for data that our cursor navigates okay so here integer i equals to one then system dot out dot print 
here just use cursor dot next okay and i plus plus that's all you have to do okay all the classes are properly imported and as you can see there are no errors as well okay now let's go ahead and check your collection in my case it is show collections and on this prompt I will get the collection within my my demo database okay so we will just use that name iris here okay so if you're in your case you just have to use show collection command to find out which collection you have okay so that being said we can go ahead and run our code and let's see what it shows okay and as you can see it has printed out the content of my database and when I say first line MongoDB connected the next line it prints out all the IDs and a respective ID number and then respective value within each of that collections data okay so this is iris data set so the content from iris data set is printed right here okay so you can pause the video go through this code and make sure that you have your database name and collection name properly added so that you will get output such as this okay